Hey everyone! So today, Miss Glamorazzi from the USA is over in England, well she's been for a while, and her and Flair are having a meet up in Westfield Shopping Centre. If you don't follow them on Twitter then you wouldn't have known about it, but if you did then woo! I'll see you there! So, um, I'm really excited. I've never been to Westfield Shopping Centre, so I don't know how long it's going to take me to drive there, but it's quarter past 11 in the morning now, and their meetup's at 2, so hopefully I'll get there in time. And also, I know there's an Inglot in Westfield Shopping Centre. Ah, I'm so excited! So, basically, I'm just wearing, like, a black three-quarter length top with a purple burnout one from Topshop, and then, like, skirt leggings and my brown boots from Topshop. My hair's pretty much just got out of bed and <laughs> my makeup I'm just wearing like a lot of different purples um, for my MAC palette I think there's like Vibrant Grape, Creme de Nude, um, Creme de Violet, Stars and Rockets and Beautiful Iris that on my eyes with a bit of Bare Minerals um, mascara, Stereo Rose blush and then Gone Romancing, yeah Gone Romancing cream lip thing from the MAC Tartan Tail Collection. That's really it on me and I'm so excited and I'm going to bring you along and we're going to go meet loads of YouTubers and in a way I'm absolutely petrified because it's kind of like you're stalking and it's going to be really 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 awkward going up to people like hi I really like you can I film you for a minute for my YouTube channel and then um, on Twitter when I mentioned I was going some of you guys were like oh I'm going too I can't wait to meet you either oh so scary so um, I hope you come up and talk to me because I'm on my own so I'm just going to be standing at Starbucks with a like frappuccino on my own looking like a right loser so <laughs> hopefully it won't turn out like that and we'll have lots of fun so stick around and hopefully we'll meet some youtubers today okay this is the scariest bloody thing i've ever done driving in actual central london i've never done this before and we're right by the o2 don't know if you're going to be able to see it there's imax there and then behind it is the OT. I don't want to get caught on my camera. Here we go. There's the OT. Can you see it? Is this so scary? I don't know where I'm going. Okay, so this is now watch cars have a panic attack as I'm in central London. I've already passed like St Paul's Cathedral. I'm now in Holborn or something. I don't know. There's red buses everywhere and I'm lost. <laughs> this is this is not fun in the slightest i'm like in the west end i think there's like i've got no idea but there's taxis and buses and oh my god i'm gonna die i don't know if we're gonna get to westfield if not we'll go on a different adventure but at the moment i'm quite close to crying so i better go um bye okay so we're here at the meet and greet for so flair and ingrid and we're with Saskia, what's your YouTube account name? It's called Saskia Lavish. Do you make videos? Yeah. Or should I should totally subscribe, I'm really sorry. Oh, are you? <laughs> yeah. So exciting. Hi. Yeah, there's loads of people, it's all very exciting. I feel like a complete stalker, but never mind. <laughs> See you later, bye! I don't know where I am. 
where I'm driving, but this looks quite cool. So if anybody knows what this is, oh, I'm Harrods. Check me out in Harrods. It's very exciting. Okay, this bus, the number 345 on some road in the middle of London, honest to God nearly killed me. So if you're the driver of that bus, I hate you very much. Hey everyone, so I'm back from London and back from the meetup. I want to say thank you very much to Saskia for keeping me company and it was really cool hanging out with you. Um, make sure you go subscribe to her, I'll put her link down below. And also thank you to Flair and Miss Glamorazzi for holding the meetup, it was really really fun and it gave me a good excuse to go shopping afterwards. So the things that I bought, I went to a shop called Beauty Base, looks like this. I'm not really sure where in Westfield it is because I've never been there before. Can't even tell which, you which floor, but basically it sells discounted makeup. So I bought some LA Colours and um, nail varnish because I love nail varnish and people in America always talk about these. So I'll show you the ones I got. They were 99p each, I think, as well, so really good value. So I got metallic pink, looks like this. Um, Treasure Island, I love glitter polish, so that one yeah. what's this one glistening purple these are from the LA colours colour craze range I don't know this one's beautiful this is called tropical storm and it's like a gunmetal grey and then the last one is jewel toned it's a really pretty jewel toned sparkly nail polish colour so I really like that so really pleased just got to put these down here Hello. <laughs> and then the other two things I went to Inglot and I know I was talking to you about it I've never been there before and I was really interested in checking out their eyeshadows and I went a bit crazy so um, in Inglot there's a system called the Freedom Palette which basically a little bit like MAC eyeshadows you get a palette and you can fill them with individual eyeshadows you can either get little round ones or bigger um, square ones or like rectangular ones and they contain more product and they come in palettes of three five or ten I think and Saskia who you've seen already and um, we went in there together and she bought a five palette of the little round ones and that cost her 15 pounds can't remember how much my one was probably about 30 something I went for the ten um, they come in like a magnetic palette like this and this slides off it's really heavily magnetised, so this is not going anywhere. The packaging's pretty cool. And then inside I've got my 10, um, I went for purple, so I've got a matte white. I'll show you the pigmentation of it. Looks like that. The pigmentation is astounding. Uh, really, really good, really creamy. They've got a lot of matte dupes in there. I found dupes for Stars and Rockets, Cranberry, um, Woodwinged, Amber Lights, Sumptuous Olive, like all the good, um, all the good, all the really popular um, shades of MAC, they've got them there, so it's really worth having a look at, definitely. So I've got three sparkly ones and the rest are pretty much matte, I think, um, and they're all varying shades of pinks and purples, and um, I really like them so far. I haven't obviously done a look with them yet, so if you want me to, then I will. But the one thing I'm not too keen on, I, although the packaging is really sturdy, because it, I'll show you, because it like clips like that, if you get it in the wrong place, you'll probably be able to take a chunk out of um, your eyeshadows, which might be quite bad. But I really, really, really like these. I think they're really affordable as well. Definitely. And then I've got a lip gloss as well. Um, this is... I don't know what colour it's in, that's a bit random, they don't, number 63, I don't know, but they come in like a little test tube, which is really, really cool, and they've got such an amazing selection of lipsticks, nail varnishes, and lip glosses, and this was £8, so it's really affordable, I love the packaging, because of a doe fur applicator, I'll put it on my lips. So it's just really natural and it's quite shimmery and it feels a little bit bitty on your lips, like a little bit grainy, but it hasn't got really a distinctive taste. Like it tastes of something, but it's not disgusting. So that's what I've bought and um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I realised I do look slightly like Miranda. Has anybody seen Miranda? Like the tall one with, he's quite big with no neck. When I was um, talking to <laughs> Flair and Miss Glamorazzi, I was like, oh my God, I look like Miranda. 
which is quite bad. So apologies for that, I'll lose some weight, I promise. <laughs> but thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.